This was how Swedish actress Numi Ripos pitched her team on doing a new movie called Lam. Okay, I'm going to do this very small Icelandic film with a first-time director, Terry's no money and Terry's like a human lamb baby, sort of. This was their, understandable, response, wait, what? As strange as it might sound, the supernatural folk tale slash family drama Lamb, in theaters now, became one of my dream projects ever, says Ripos, who plays adopted mother to a hybrid sheep girl. And even though there's that old Hollywood adage to never work with children or animals, director slash co-writer Valdemar Johansson used both to create the most visually arresting character in an intriguing film about parenthood and man versus nature that's destined to be a conversation starter. No Time to Die, Lamb, Netflix There's Someone Inside Your House. brother Pieter, Bjorn Lenner Haraldsson, a black sheep of sorts who questions his sibling's decision. Not to mention the various forces of nature, including one very ticked off mama you, create overwhelming tension in the couple's lives. Maria is trapped in almost a limbo reality in the beginning, Ripos says. Her heart is put on hold because it's kind of impossible to recover from losing a child. She's just getting on with her life and then she's given this beautiful opportunity to be a mother again. Or maybe she just takes it. But how she balances between extreme fragility and strength and rage in this primal, almost violent side, that combined with the visual, look of Ada, was just for me mind-blowing. Icelandic farmer gave her lamb delivering skills a stellar review, her director Johansson reports, he was saying it was like Numi had been doing it forever. There were a bunch of animals on the farm where cast and crew lived and worked. Carlos the cat, who plays Maria and Ingvar's persnickety pet, was the biggest diva, Ripos says. It was his house and he felt like we were intruders. But Ada, who quickly grows from baby to toddler during the film, was the result of a team effort involving one lamb, nine human children, two puppeteers and a bunch of visual effects. Ten thrilling, chilling films to watch for Halloween 2021. The lamb who played Ada was very small and handy in the beginning, Ripos says. You could just hold her. They filmed lamb in two different time frames, however, and by the second block of production Ada had grown to around 70 to 80 pounds, it's a big baby, Ripos admits, adding that the lamb became attached to them, as did the kids. Some of the children were easier to work with and some were more strong-minded and wild but they were also growing. who has a teenage son, began to feel maternal about Ada halfway through filming. I forgot that she was not real, she says. I totally feel like Maria took over my system and I became the mother of Ada. It was intense. The actress recalls one divine moment where Maria puts a flower crown on Ada's head. Ripos was up close to the usually squirming young sheep's face and all of a sudden she just became so still and we got this really powerful connection. 
We started breathing each other's air. It felt like we had a secret language. As the on-screen Ada grows and gets more mobile and social like a real kid, Johansson maintained a constant balance between human and animal. For example, Ada understands what her parents are saying but doesn't communicate back the same way. In early iterations of the script, she was talking a lot, the filmmaker says. But then we just realized that she should not speak. Somehow we felt that would make her stronger. Since debuting Lam at Ken in July, Ripos and Johansson have attended screenings and Q and as where people dressed up as lambs. They've also had heated conversations and discussions about the movie's themes. My favorite movies are the ones that are not so straightforward, Ripos says. It has the simplicity to it, but it's like a volcano underneath. I would love people to allow themselves to be totally impolite and just have their own take on it. And if they don't like it, that's fine, too. But I love that it evokes emotions.